All right, so the next one here, a U.S. covert missile launcher that the New York Times says could lead to Xi's ouster. So this article is from Kyle Anzalone, um, and it is about these missiles that the U.S. is going to deploy into Asia. Uh, apparently, they've already been deployed to Asia. So after the U.S. withdrew from a major nuclear arms treaty with Russia in 2019, the Pentagon began to develop weapons that would have violated that agreement. Such a covert missile has now been deployed to the Philippines as part of the U.S. military buildup surrounding China. The New York Times reports that this system to be a covert uh they're saying that this system is a covert missile launcher that Washington believes could jeopardize Xi Jinping's position as the president of China, which is kind of a crazy way to report on this missile. Um, so this is the uh, Typhoon launcher or Typhon, is it 1-0? Um, and so they're sending these missiles. It's the Typhon. I guess that's how you pronounce it. T-Y-P-H-O-N. Uh, but it launches the Tomahawk cruise missiles. And it's a land-based launcher. So under the INF Treaty, the Intermediate Range Nuclear Forces Treaty, this would have been prohibited. But the U.S. pulled out of the INF Treaty with Russia in 2019 and started developing these land-based missiles at this range immediately um, to deploy them near China. Uh, it was very clear that was kind of the point of the of you know they accused China uh, Russia of violating the treaty. They didn't try to do any sort of diplomacy to you know to work it out they pulled out and they started developing these missiles and now apparently they sent them to uh the philippines and according to the new york times the u.s is hoping to use these launchers to protect taiwan from a chinese attack and they believe that these missiles would could be enough to thwart an invasion of taiwan and even force xi from power if be in beijing if an invasion fails um so they have again this is what you know the type of thinking and, and discussions that they're having it's really uh it's really crazy stuff um so they've been deployed there uh and f they're saying for a potential conflict in the south china sea as well they could be used for that um so scary stuff.